Hello my perfume lovers, addicts, fanáticas de perfume como yo. Welcome back to another video. Thank you for being here. As you can see, I have a new look. I hope you like it. I definitely needed a change and well, there you go. So this is the new me for now. And yes, thanks to my hairstylist, Patricia, and I will link her information below just in case you're in the Florida area. Of course, you know, she does miracles, okay? So I have been in a fruity fragrance mood. Usually I'm not a fruity fragrance type of person. I'm more into deep, spicy vanillas, creamy fragrances, um, just those sexy florals and all of that, you know, really bold, you know, um, beast mode type of fragrances, but I've been in a fruity, juicy mood. So if you've been watching my previous videos, I got obsessed with banana this year. Last year I was obsessed with, I mean, with mango. Now I'm obsessed with mango. Last year I was having a, a, a moment, a banana moment. This time I'm having a mango moment and the mango moment has gone really, really long. So um, that's gonna be my next video. I'm gonna talk about more mango fragrances that I purchased and comparing them to the niche fragrance uh the niche mango fragrances that i've looked into and all of that so let's get into my first juicy fruity fragrance okay so the first one that i'm going to talk about is probably my favorite it's Mayar from la tapa that's the top so this one is so juicy and delicious this one has raspberry and uh, lychee lychee however you say it and it's so juicy fruity fun girly um and this just it, it gives you this good mood it's just mood boosting and just so fun i'm just gonna spray just one time just one time oh it's so good and as you can see i've been going through it this one is a dupe for angel nova which is perfect and love it juicy also and fruity but this one i feel is juicier and a little bit more sour in a way but i like it better than this one so there you go that's that the next one that i have on my list is from my banana obsession this is ambrosia imperial by navitus so this is that spiced candy like um banana i'm gonna spray once Oh, it's so good it's beautiful okay that's that okay the next juicy fragrance from my list is another one from Mugler this is Angel Ice Star and this is a beautiful pineapple pineapple a little bit of coconut and a little bit of um, patchouli but this is such a fun juicy um bright um fruity fragrance for summer and you know we can we're it we're in spring getting into summer all of that it doesn't matter this is good now it's unfortunately discontinued but um yeah and i'm going like i'm already like halfway which is scary so i don't want to spray this right now but it's really good you really get the pineapple in this one i really love that the next one that I'm going to talk about is a Love Ajajeb Dubai Portrait by La Tafa. This is a beautiful, juicy mango, but it's mixed with the, the Osmantis. So it's like a creamy, creamy Osmantis mixed with a mango. And it has a little bit of the, of the lemon in there, but you definitely get the mango. And this smells like a luxurious beautiful oh mango fragrance okay there's that the next one from my list is one that i had forgotten about apple brandy on the rocks by killian so this one has of course apple um but it is a boozy fragrance and when i say booze i mean rum brandy and it has apple and it has pineapple so it makes it bright and perfect for this time you can really wear it probably year round but oh is really good and there are um several imitations for this tarot dupes i have um well i have uh from alexandria there's apple brandy i mean i forgot the name of their dupe there's one from dua and there and there's also one from juliana's perfume they have dupes for all of for this one so this is really good it when you first spray it it might seem a little bit masculine but don't like don't just smell your skin 
just spray it on and let it just radiate and just it's really nice and but again if you don't like that liquor like booze type of smell i would say get a sample first and, and all of that okay the next one that i'm going to mention is scandal apari one that i had neglected for so long so so long but since i'm in this juicy fruity mood this one has the pear and it's a really juicy pear and it's mixed with the honey um and some jasmine but you just get this this is like a jolly rancher type of smell it's really fruity and really good longevity also so juicy so good there's that the next one that i'm going to talk about is cloud pink okay so this one does go it is juicy and it's fruity but it does it is sweet so this is a sweet fruity fun fragrance and because it has the the pineapple pitaya and the wild berries and this is just one of those fun flirty ones oh it's so good this is my favorite cloud so far okay okay the next one that i have is one of my favorite well my favorite mango fragrance is desire to buy dua this stuff is good this is i'm just gonna spray it because it's a whole experience it's a whole thing when you spray this okay oh, this is a delicious juicy mango it smells like the mango is in here it's so natural and so juicy and so good and then it gets creamy and a little bit lactonic and it's just like the longevity is good this is just i love it I love I can't stop wearing it. I can't I already ordered a backup bottle, so yeah. The next one that I'm going to mention is one that I just recently got, like literally two days ago or like a day ago. And this is Nar the Narco Oasis by Narcotica, the dapper version. Okay, so I've been looking for a passion fruit fragrance. I have got a little bit obsessed on that, and I was searching and searching and searching, and this is what keeps popping up now i'm going to spray this this is one of dapper is also uh, one of these um fragrance houses that you have to let them sit for sometimes for the the juice to get where it's supposed to be and i feel like i'm getting the passion fruit and this is a juicy passion fruit but since i just got it i am getting like what is what i'm smelling is um okay you know the the cough drops the cherry cough drops but i think it's the luden luden's brand which they taste really good so you end up eating them instead of like using them how they're supposed to be used well at least i do <laughs> and they then they so they smell good and they taste really juicy and yummy not like a regular cough drop that's what this is smelling like right now but i'm gonna i know it's gonna get better so i included it because it smells really juicy yes yes it's gonna get so much better now the last one that i have is called mango flesh another mango um by dua this is the imitation for mango skin by v wilhelm perfume i'm not sure how to say that but wilhelm okay this one this one this is juicy this smells like i'm gonna tell you what it smells like i've been wearing it a lot oh this tastes like a mango i mean this tastes I didn't eat it. I didn't eat it. This smells like a mango that is so ripe that it's about to go bad. Like you need to eat it or it's going to go bad mixed with like a sangria. So it's like, that's what I get. Sangria, like a sangria drink mixed with this. And that is what I'm smelling. Okay. So it's really nice, really juicy. You got to like that type of thing. Okay. Now, the last ones that i have are just honorable mentions which um so i have very good girl by carolina herrera because this is also fruity um and it's it is really nice so this is uh because it has the the lychee i think it has some berries and the rose and it's just really really nice this is a nice designer one that is uh, smells really good really good and the other one i have i have three different dupes of it is lovely cherry by uh, mason alhambra and i have amarena cherry by fragranza and i have fructis virginis by alexandria 
these are all lost cherry dupes by tom ford but they are all really good you know so i just wanted to include all of them so yeah cherry is is fruity but i feel like cherry i like it more for cooler weather because it can get a little bit too sweet it could get a little bit weird it could be a little bit artificial when it's hot that type of thing so these are just honorable mentions yeah also i wanted to include in here this fragrance that i purchased that didn't work out for me i have it on my mercari i posted that on my community um page because so i'll show you the bottle is beautiful i love it here it is the bottle is beautiful cassiopeia by tiziana terenzi okay so this is a passion fruit fragrance but and it is similar to um el vapura kirk kirke kirk however you say it um but this is a more creamier and the and the musk is very much toned down but it's still i just realized that the the tiziana terenzi musk is not for me even though it's really toned down it's very creamy in here i still get a little bit of the similarity to kirk or kirke and i just realized that that's not the dna i don't like that scent profile so um the passion fruit is definitely in here but it's just it's not for me it's not for me but i know somebody else would enjoy it okay so there it is on my makari or anyone who wants it um so yeah those are my fruity fragrances i hope that you like them let me know what you think let me know some of your fruity fragrances that you like to wear when you want to you know all those um fruity moments that we have well that i have and yeah thank you so much for watching everyone until next time bye